Hello guys, it is iPod Touch Baller. Um, I have a slight problem. As you see here, I have the videos icon and the music icon. Both of which are very important to me. But I want them in the dock. And I only have one spot left. And I need all these in there. What should I do? I got an idea. Uh, why don't we make the iPod application for those? Because in this video, I'm going to show you how to do that without a computer. Um, it's the name. It's in the iSpazio source, I believe. Just go into installer. Wait for that to come up. Now, what you need to do? It's going to install all packages or also tweaks, just not just regular tweaks. Well, actually, let's just do it that way because I don't re exactly remember it. Just go down to tweaks. As you see, know, there's tweaks 1.1.1 and all that. Just tweaks. And then, what you're going to have to do, scroll down, and you will see Touch Pod, right there. And it removes the music and videos icons, adding the iPod icon, like the iPhone. This application only is for the iPod Touch, not for the iPhone. Install. It shouldn't take too long. It's only 1.8. Uh, it's not gonna take too long. And hit the home button. Back to the home screen, and you'll see right there in my dock. That's where I had it when I uninstalled it. Uh, but it sh I think for you guys it would be over here and it is iPod if you go into it look at the bottom you'll see they have the videos and also your music stuff so then you just put that in the dock and my problem solved and that's how you get the iPod app, replacing music and videos without SSHing, because that's how a lot of people do it. That's how I used to always do it. I used to always have to SSH every time I restored. This is just a lot easier. So, comment, rate, subscribe, especially comment down there about my voice quality, comparing it to 2.0 firmware update, because new mic. And, uh, comment, rate, subscribe, later.